Okay, well, I started doing clinics when I was in eighth grade. No, when I was eight years old. So there's no teams until you're in eighth grade. So I played on the eighth grade team. And then my freshman year of high school, I've been on the varsity team since. And I was captain last year, and I'm captain this year again. Um, I started playing in eighth grade, and I made the varsity team as a sophomore, so I've been loving it and playing till right now. <laughs> Excellent. Hi. Uh, don't know why I said hi. <laughs> 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 um, my whole family played field hockey, so I got into it young doing clinics. Played on the eighth grade team, was on JV two years and varsity two years. Hopkinton Hillers field hockey is back at practice, and this year's team features an experienced squad. I think our team's looking great this year. We have 15 returning players and we have five new players. So we'll have a total team of 20, one's a goalie. And yesterday we had like a jamboree thing in Needham's where we played five 20 minute halves and we won four of them and lost one. So I think we're gonna have a great season. All right, terrific. What's your take on the team this year? Yeah, um, the team this year is really good. I think that with only five new players, it's like better because we have the stronger team from last year, and then we're only adding five new in. So it's like doing really well so far, and hopefully we come really far into the tournament this year. We only lost one um, starting player last year, so and one goalie. So we already have like a really good team chemistry going on. So I think that um, if we just continue out from last year, we should be. Really team. good. I think this team looks strong this year. Um, I was impressed. We had a scrimmage yesterday. Our first game, we had to get the jitters out, I think. And, you know, from then on in, I thought we gelled as a team and the players seemed to work together nicely. What I have this year, which I don't a lot of times have, is a very strong bench as well. So that will work out great. Not only do the Hillers have good experience on the field, but also on the sidelines. I've been coaching varsity level for 11 years. Um, I've coached JV level two years prior to that. Um, and I've, one year on 2010, we won, 2008, we won states. So that was an exciting year for us. And our goal, my goal every year is to make tournament. I asked about some of the drills the team has been working on. Um, we do be like basic skills. So we're working on the fundamentals of field hockey and then we build up to game-like situation so we can really get the basics down because you can never practice the stuff you learn first enough. Okay, do you have a favorite drill that you've been uh, working on so far? Um, I usually just like the shooting drills and just passing with the team, getting to know everybody. Um, we did a lot of running in the beginning of practice, but it helps us become stronger. So. All right, what about you? What are some of the things you're working on early on here? Um, I'm a big fan of like the hitting, passing drills. I think that's a really important part of the game, um, moving the ball around to being able to. Um, also, I think the game-like situations, we do like 3v2s, 2v1s, things like that. Those are really important, good to practice. Um, early on, uh, getting their passes down, getting, you know, we have to really learn how to play on turf because a lot of these girls didn't play on turf before. We were on grass and this year I think we're going to be always on turf. We have to work on their speed and their timing on the, on the drills. The Hillers will be making a transition this season to playing on artificial turf a lot more. I asked the coach what the major differences are between playing on artificial turf compared to grass. Uh, turf is so much smoother, so much more predictable and a lot faster. So you have to be in better condition. 